This is the final day of the July series of my true nature. So we're going to really talk about your true nature. Got a good good stuff today. And then we're going to put the series all together. And then um, you're going to want to stay tuned for next week or the end of this call because I'm going to give you a little bit of sneak peek on what's coming for next month, August. Ah, oh, so good. So you've got your space. We move our body. We use powerful, positive words. We breathe. This practice, remember, this practice is movement, mantras, meditation, and music. Got my oils. My favorite is joy. It is my word for the year. And um, until I feel 100% confident and comfortable that I'm bringing joy into my life all the time, I will continue to use my joy oil. Ah, and it smells so good because... I you I would what you would call but the nor regular everyday average person would call that type A personality where I'm work then play, but you know the work never ends, and so playtime gets cut and that's not fun at all, at all. So let's bring joy in. So what is it that you want to bring into your day, into your life on a regular basis? I want you to bring it, be aware of it, be mindful of it, self awareness. And that's what I want to talk about today. So you've got your oil, you've got your space. I'm going to share something with you today. We're going to get moving. I'm reading a book. Darn, It's called Darn Easy. Brian Proctor and Peggy McCall. They are um, Brian Proctor's Bob Proctor's son. If you're familiar with Bob Proctor, I was in his coaching program. I was one of his students. Phenomenal practice. And Peggy McCall is also, was a student and also a, a teacher of, of Bob's work. Reading the book and Peggy shared a story. And I want to share this story with you because oftentimes people say, Don, what is manifesting really? Like, how do I act as if I'm where I want to be if I'm not? How do I act as if the bank account is overflowing when I just bounced a check? How do I act as if I'm in this relationship that I love when I'm alone? How do I act as if I'm living the dream job when every day my boss is yelling at me? So I want to share this story because those are all very good points. <laughs> this is happening. It's real, Dawn. It's real. How do I get there? Because that's what I want. I want that. I don't want this. This doesn't feel good. So I don't. How do I stop feeding what I don't want and feed what I want? So Peggy shares a story. Her house was for sale for over a year. This is in the book, darn easy. Her house was for sale. She for a year, and she was frustrated. She's standing out in front of the for sale sign. She's like, oh. I'm frustrated. And then she realized, I don't want to be frustrated. I want to feel as if my house is sold. That's the work we do. Feel as if what we want to feel. So we create it. We become a magnet to what we want, right? So she said, okay. She calls her realtor and says, bring me a for sale, a sold sign. Bring me, a, and her realtor was a little confused, but said, okay, bring you the sold sign. And stuck the sold sign on top of her, her, her um, her for sale sign and had her realtor take a picture of her standing next to the sign. Sold! Yay! And her realtor was confused and the neighbors came out and they're like, oh, you sold your house. She goes, it's coming. And they're like, what the heck do you mean? <laughs> she said, this is a visualization practice. I want to feel as if my house is sold, that the person who wants to move in this house and make memories like I did is coming and they're here and how good it feels when that sold sign is on that sign. As I feel like, oh, it feels so good. I'm so excited, right? How do we create that and feel that every day, live in that? Well, three months later, her house sold after being on the market for a year. That's manifesting. That's being in the state we want to create. So now I want to share with you something I discovered. Recently, my husband and I have been in this sort of on the different different like disagreement, for lack of better words, a disagreement. We're trying to figure out where we want to go, how we want to feel, how do we resolve this thing that's kind of putting a wrench in our happiness, our joy, our connection, right? What's and I found myself, and it's been a couple weeks, it's been a while, so it's like, oh, 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 where do, how do we get back to where we were, happy and joyful and 
loving and connected, right? Instead of frustrated and and sad and disappointed and blah, the list goes on. And we had another conversation the other day and it had time to be alone for myself and just to kind of think through, like I work in the garden and that's my place where I can think and just be connected. When I'm in, I should have had a picture taken. When I'm in my garden, shorts, t-shirt, hands are in the dirt, I'm bare feet, I'm filthy, I'm in the dirt and I'm connected and I'm rooted and I'm connected to my true nature and who I am digging in the dirt. And I had time to think. And then I recalled Peggy's story. She wanted to feel as if her house is sold. How do I want to feel? I want to feel as if I'm connected to my husband, that we're on the same page, that we're moving forward, that we're loving each other, respecting each other, embracing each other's journeys, right? So, okay, I'm tired of feeling frustrated. And the more frustrated I am, isn't going to make it any better. So how do I want to feel? I want to feel kind. I want to feel loving. I want to feel happy. I want to play. I want more joy. So last night I was looking through my book. I had some time to just, well, after a long day of gardening, my body's a little achy. So I had time last night to just actually fall asleep in my hammock. I decided to read a little bit before bed and I pulled my affirmation card. And I wanna read it to you because it's pretty powerful. Because I'm asking, I'm, an, I'm manifesting, I'm asking, this is what I need. So higher self, universe, God, Show me the way. What do I need? Help me. I'm, I'm ready. I'm willing. I'm able to make the shift, right? Make the shift to love. So here's my uh, card I got. I let go of the shadow of the past by seeing someone for the first time with the eyes of love. I'm telling you, these things don't happen by accident. I let go, you might want to write this one down, it's a good one. I let go of the shadow of the past by seeing someone for the first time with the eyes of love. If I want to get to love, I have to see someone, a situation, myself, through the eyes of love. Or things don't shift. If I see through frustration, I'll be in frustration. If I see through love, I move into love. I create love. So I invite you to do the same. Maybe you're feeling that, maybe you have that. Maybe there's something going on for you that's you're feeling stuck in and you need to connect to who you are. You need to connect to what you want. Ask for guidance, ask, feel from love. How would I act if I was acting from love? How would I be presenting if I was presenting from love? Love. How would I be feeling? How would I be showing up? What are the words I will be using? So I invite you to do that. Here's our affirmations for today. I see my true nature. I connect to who I am. I am part of it all. I come back home. I come back home to love. And it did, it took me digging in the dirt, connecting with nature, being one, being quiet, being with me to figure out where I was lost in frustration and anger and resentment and just confusion. And you come back home. I want love. What do I really want? I want love. I want peace. I want joy. I want compassion. I want fun. I want evolving together, right? And we come back to that. We have to choose it. We have to choose it. Because we can, there's plenty to be frustrated about. There's plenty to be. I'm right, you're wrong, or this, or that. What do we want? We want understanding, we want joy. So we have to return back to it. We're gonna do that. So I want you to stand nice and tall. Just begin with your hands on your heart, eyes closed for just a moment, and tune in to where more love is needed. Tune in to where you want to shift into your true nature, to connect to who you really are, because who you really are is love, compassion, joy, Frustration, anger, it's a part of us that comes from external responses. We are internally who we are is love, joy. Turn it on. Turn it on. Tune in. 
breathe it in and see that situation. See that situation with love. See that situation surrounded by the bubble of light, that big, beautiful bubble of light and protection. See it, feel it, and know it. This is who I choose to be. I see my true nature. I connect to who I am. I am part of it all. I come back home. Breathe that in for just a moment. Breathe it in. Feel it. Embrace it. Choose it. If you feel that resistance, resistance to it, can you come back to it? I choose love, even though I'm frustrated, even though I'm right, even though whatever it is, your story is in your head. What do you want? I want to be heard. I want to be happy. I choose joy. I choose connection. I choose understanding. Feel that. Inhale, big breath all the way up, arms all the way up, reach, reach, reach. Exhale, hands down, shake it out, shake it out. Let's get moving. We're going to march. I'm going to get the music going for us. Should be able to hear that. Just a little bit of music, a little bit of jam. Just march it out, shake it out. Now, this is a really fun series. We're going to get that body moving. I see my true nature. I connect to who I am. I am part of it all. I come back home. Let's get it going. This is our first move. It's good. It's good. Just kind of like a dance. Move your hips. Use your legs. Just feel. Look side to side. I see my true nature. I see my true nature. I see my true nature. Yes. Your true nature is light. It flows. It's fun. Yes. Right here is surrender. Up and down. Up. Big arms. Up. Down. Surrender. I connect to who I am. I connect to who I am. I connect to who I am. Good. Keep it going. Now, good. I'll surrender. Up and out. Up and out. Good. Surrender. Up, out, up. Out. I see my true nature. I connect to who I am. I see my true nature. I connect to who I am. I see my true nature. I connect to who I am. Real power. Circle. Circle. Just circle those arms. You got it. Circle. Circle. Just circle. You can do a step touch. Remember, we're just moving the body. Activate your energy, mind, body, spirit. Willpower. I am part of it all. 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 Connecting. Good. Determined. Reach. Reach your arms all the way up. And adjust a little bit here. Here we go. Ready? Reach and pull. Reach and pull. Reach. You can bring your knee up. Pull it in. Pull it in. And speed it up a little bit. Reach and pull. Determine. Pull it in. Pull it in. Good. And come back home. I come back home. Pull it in. I come back home. I come back home. Good. Now circle. Willpower. Determined. Reach and pull. Willpower. I am part of it all. I come back home. I am part of it all. I come back home. 
I am part of it all. I've come back home. Back to good. Good. Surrender. Up and down. Willpower. Circle. Determine. Reach and pull. Good. I see my true nature. I connect to who I am. I am part of it all. I come back home. See my true nature. I connect to who I am. I'm part of it all. I come back home. Good, right here. Remember, we embody the state of the move. Surrender, let go of what's not serving you. Willpower. Determine, reach and pull. Let's do our affirmations one more time. Good, right here, shake it out. We're gonna do that block one more time. Good is our next move. Here we go in four, three, two, good. I see my true nature. Just connect to who I am. I am part of it all. I come back home. Good, shake it out. We're gonna do a little challenge now. We're gonna put the entire month together. This is July 31st. Tomorrow's August 1st. Tomorrow starts a whole new series. So when you come back and join me, we're going to be on our new series called I. Oh. Now I just forgot what it is. I'm so excited about it too, because it's really good. The power of you tapping into your true power. Talk about manifesting. August is going to be a month of manifesting the power of you co-creating your life, manifesting all your desires. Okay. Now back to right now. It's like a commercial break. Here's our moves. We've got carefree, willing, uplift and serve excited v-step happy play commitment ease rise flow good surrender willpower determined each move you embody the state of the move each move has a name because we embody the state so we're going to go through all 16 moves all 16 affirmations got about 10 minutes we're going to do this we can do this right we're going to create the state we want to be in today and for the rest of the week. You've got this. Choose it. It's your choice. Choice is your superpower. We have a choice. How am I going to show up every day? And then we're going to do the affirmations. We're going to add them in. I will read them to you now. I connect to the earth. This bond is sacred. It gives me life. I return the favor. I walk in wonder. I bask in awe. I breathe in joy. I am rooted in love. I commit to honor the gifts we are given, the song of the wind, the flow of the river. I see my true nature. I connect to who I am. I am part of it all. I come back home. Yeah, come back home. Who do you choose to be? How are you going to show up today? Let's do it. Ready? Here we go. Can you hear the music and the words? Here we go. Carefree. Here we go. Down, down, up, down. Willing, pull it in, uplift, circle these arms, serve, give from the heart, excited, walk, Woo. B step, from the heart, happy, big arms, play, rooted in love, commitment, reach up, ease, Woo. I can't forget what ease is. Here we go. Rise. Down. Up. Up. I remember now. Flow. We'll come back to it. Good. See, it doesn't matter. We just play and have fun. Surrender. Up and out. We just did this. Willpower. Circle. Determine. Pull it in. Carefree. Down, down, up, down. Tell your body where to go. Willing, pull it in. Uplift, circle those arms. Serve from the heart. 
excited, walk it out. Kick your butt. V-step. Happy. Big arms. Play. Drum it out. Commitment. Reach it up. Now ease. Big ease. Big sweep. Rise. Down, down, up, up. Flow, flow, just sweep the arms. Good. Surrender. Up and down. A big, big bow. Willpower. Determined. Pull it in. We're gonna add the words. I connect the earth. Willing. This bond is sacred. Uplift. It gives me life. Serve, I return the favor. Excited, I walk in wonder. V step, I bask in awe. Happy, I breathe in joy. Play, I am rooted in love. Commit, I commit to honor. Ease, the gifts we are given. Rise, the song of the wind. Flow, the flow of the river. Good, I see my true nature. Connect to who I am. Willpower, I am part of it all. Determined, I come back home. One more time, connect to the earth. Bond is sacred. It gives me life. Serve, I return the favor. Excited, I walk in wonder. V step, I bask in awe. Happy, I breathe in joy. Play, I am rooted in love. Commit, I commit to honor. Ease, the gifts we are given. Rise, song of the wind flow of the river. Good. I see my true nature. I surrender, connect to who I am. Willpower, I'm part of it all. Determined, I come back home. Good. Inhale up all the way. Exhale. Shake it all out. Shake it all out. Just let everything go. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Good, 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 good. Shake, 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 shake. Inhale up. Exhale, release. Hands of the heart. Eyes closed if you like. And silently repeat the words. Let them resonate in your heart. Let them pulse in every cell of your body. Feel with a gentle smile on your lips the power of your words. And the power of your words to create a feeling, a state that you want to live in and walk in today and every day. Breathe in. Exhale. I connect to the earth. This bond is sacred. It gives me life. I return the favor. I walk in wonder. I bask in awe. I breathe in joy. I am rooted in love. I commit to honor the gifts we are given, the song of the wind, the flow of the river. I see my true nature. I connect to who I am. I am part of it all. I come back home. Feel your body. Feel your breath. Feel the power the energy you create for you. You are who you choose to be. Come back to your true nature. Inhale all the way up, palms reach. Exhale, palms together at the heart center. Pressing the palms together at the heart center. Center, we end in the pose of gratitude. Grateful, appreciating everything, who we are, what we do, how we show up. Press the palms together and just say silently to yourself, I am so happy and grateful for. 
I am so happy and grateful for my home, my thriving business, my beautiful relationships. I'm blessed with my children. I'm blessed with this every breath in my body every day. Just be grateful for something. Choose it right now. And stay connected to your heart. Stay connected to who you really are. So we press the palms together at the heart center. Inhale. Exhale. May the love, the peace, and the light in each and every one of you shine bright for the world to see. Namaste. And if you believe a powerful positive shift has occurred here today, we reach the arms up to the sky and we say, yes, yes. And so it is. Yes, yes. And so it is. High five. Yes. Great job. Great job. Awesome. Thanks for being here today. And next week, join me for the power of you. How do we tap into the power of who we truly are? That's what we're going to be talking about next month. Absolutely consciously choosing who we are meant to be. And it's perfect timing. This is a perfect series because I'm launching my coaching program. Launches, our start date is September 1. And I have five spots available, five. So you wanna get on a call with me. The link will be right here under these, in the show notes, as you could say. You're interested, you're curious, like Dawn, I wanna know more. I, I don't know more, I, I, I don't know enough yet to sign up then schedule a call with me just 30 minutes or or if you just have a few questions however you know less than 30 let me answer your questions let me tell you a little bit about the program it's seven month coaching program it's going to be beautiful it's like access to all this good stuff that i teach and these little nuggets here you get it for you in the palm of your hands now there's five spots available because those five spots those four five get to join me in guatemala as my guest Yes, it's true. So big deal. So you have until September 1st to get signed up to join me. So until then, we have about four weeks to get on a call and let's chat and let's talk about it. So see you next week on my calendar. Let's talk the image shift, how to create the powerful, positive self-image. So you stop waiting and start creating the life that you desire. All right. I look forward to talking with you soon. Have an amazing day, and until next week, let your light shine bright for all to see.